It's been a project for countries around the world to collect and preserve all kinds of seeds so that humanity will have access to these species no matter what happens. South Korea, too, is working to preserve hundreds of species of vegetables by storing their seeds for the next hundred years. Park Se-young has more. Sturdily packed boxes have arrived at South Korea's gene bank. Inside the boxes are some 7,500 seed samples from 87 plants. The seeds will be kept in the National Agrobiodiversity Center's cold storage unit. This is the first batch sent by the Taiwan-based World Vegetable Center after the Rural Development Administration decided to safeguard all seed samples in case of emergency. The gene bank will receive 65,000 seeds from 456 vegetable species by 2024. The seeds will be preserved at minus 20 degrees Celsius for about 100 years. They'll be taken out only in case of seed extinction and returned for you. The National Agrobiodiversity Center was designated as one of the world's gene banks by the UN Food and Agriculture Organization in 2008. It is currently home to 27,000 seed samples from 10 countries, including Vietnam and Mongolia. The center's triple-walled storage unit has five-layer floors to maintain temperature and humidity and can withstand bombings and magnitude 7 earthquakes. With our world-class facilities, we plan to preserve genetic resources from home and abroad and ensure a safe, redundant preservation of seeds worldwide. Agricultural plant seeds are not only the basis for food production, but are also used as basic materials for various fields like medicine, making seed preservation even more important. Park Se-young, Arirang News.